Hey guys, it's Kelly, and today for Nail Art Sunday, I'm doing this super fun under the sea kind of manicure. <laughs> I haven't done a stamping manicure in a really long time, and I just got a new plate from Bundle Monster, and I don't know, it was just inspiring me. So I came up with this manicure. It has a really fun, like, smooshy background, which is supposed to be like the ocean. So let me just show you how I did it. So for this manicure, I'm going to use my base coat as per usual, and then a nice solid ocean blue as well as a really light blue just for a little highlight and a really dark blue. And I'm also using this gold stamping polish from Bundle Monster as well as some liquid latex and my high gloss top coat. And then this is the little kit that I got from Bundle Monster and it has like a ton of different stuff in it which is really cute. But I wanted to use this stamping plate specifically if you're not familiar with nail art stamping. Basically it's just a metal plate with designs etched into it and you paint your nail polish over it, you scrape off the excess, and then you use a rubber stamper to get it on your nail. And I'm about to show you guys how I did it. So starting off with my clean natural nail and applying my base coat as I normally do And then I'm going to take that medium blue shade and that's gonna be my base color for my little smooshy manicure And I'm going to paint a couple of coats of that onto my nails while that's drying I'm gonna go in with some liquid latex just to protect the skin around my nails This is an optional step, but the next step is going to be a little bit messy So if you're allergic to latex, I would definitely put some tape around your nails or something just to protect that skin and make it easier to get off later so even though I'm not going to be using the stamping yet, I am going to use the little rubber stamper that came with this kit. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a silicone mat, which also happens to be from Bundle Monster. Oh my gosh, what are the odds? Just kidding, that was totally planned. Ha ha ha. Anyway, I'm going to take my blue polish and then I'm just going to put some dots of the darker and some dots of the lighter in there and just get a nice good amount onto the mat. And then I'm going to take my stamper and I'm actually going to stamp all of that wet polish. And then I'm going to take that and I'm going to to stamp it onto my nails. So what that's gonna do is that's gonna create like, I don't know, this really smooshed kind of design. And it just looks cool and random and it kind of felt a little oceany to me. So I really like that. I ended up, it looks a little dark to me. So I ended up just going back in a tiny bit just to get a couple of the little lighter bits on there as well, just cause I wanted a nice variation of color. And then I'm going to take a little piece of tape and I'm gonna clean off that stamper because I'm about to use it again. I'm gonna peel off the liquid latex just because the other stamp that I'm gonna be doing does not get messy. So I'm gonna just start with this gold polish and I'll take a little fish and I'm going to just use my little stamper and stamp that onto my nails. When I first started with stamping, it was not a clear stamper so you couldn't see where you were going. So I love that they make these clear stampers now. It makes life so much easier. So I'm also gonna do a little shell. Each nail is gonna be different assorted designs from this little kit. Also threw in a little anchor because you can't have an ocean without an anchor, am I right? And once that is totally dry, it doesn't take that long just because stamping is super fast. I'm going to go in with a nice thick coat of my glossy top coat and that is it for my ocean design. Look at that little octopus on my ring finger. Is that not the cutest thing you guys have ever seen? I'm totally in love with it. Anyway, that's it for this manicure. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what you think if you wanna see more stamping nail art and make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, bye.